Do this for you. all the naysayers and haters who made me one of the greatest. I know it kills you inside, that's why I do this for you. I do this for my father, who I've only seen from time to time in my dreams. I do this for you. Welcome back boys, Pepperoni's here with another GTA tutorial video. And today's tutorial video boys is the Saw Mill Time Trial. Now boys, this time trial is very, very easy. Honestly, um, I can't remember an easier time trial. All you have to do is know the route. And if you know the route, you can do this time trial in any motorcycle pretty much any supercar and i say maybe like the top five or six sports cars in gta so boys <laughs> this is the easiest hundred thousand i've made in a very very long time now i just want to ask you guys please go out there follow me on twitter and if you haven't uh followed me on mixer yet boys please follow me on mixer all right, I stream three to four days a week during the weekdays, and I'd love to see all you guys there. Now, this gets straight into the video. So the first thing you want to do once you get to the time trial, boys, is just start the time trial up. Go to your map, and then find the location of the finish line. Wow, it's actually pretty far away, boys. But they give you a ton of time. Now, don't worry about the route that they give you right here. I got the perfect route. All you got to do is pay attention to the video. But you do need to know where the finish line is at. Now, all you got to do after that is hold the Y button if you're on the Xbox and the equivalent on PlayStation to restart your race. Now, once you restart your race, boys, what you want to do is you want to position your motorcycle or vehicle, whatever you got, so you're as far out of the time trial as possible. Then, as soon as you start the race, boys, just hold the trigger button. And if you're on the Shitaro, the How Could You Drag, press left up on the left stick and if you're on any other uh, motorcycle press back on the left stick to go as fast as possible now this race boys is all about the route that you take not about your top speed that's why you can do this race in pretty much any vehicle in the game that's a sports car a motorcycle uh, yeah, just, any, just pretty much almost any vehicle any vehicle that has a good speed to it so boys all you want to do is pretty much follow the route I'm taking right here now, I'm going to pretty much be going in a straightaway this whole entire time, so there's not that many turns at all. All you want to do, basically, is follow these train tracks pretty much until you get to the airport. So, what I learned about doing this is, it seemed as if my motorcycle would go a little bit faster when I would be closer to the actual, like, uh, vertical tracks. I don't know why. But it seemed like when I was in the middle, it wasn't going as fast. Now, you might notice the same thing. It, you can almost hear my engine rev up when I get closer to the, uh, to the vertical lines on the train track. Now, right here, boys, I mean, you, you really ain't got no turns. It's pretty much a straightaway. There's no real traffic. And I do advise you guys to do this during the daytime. Uh, at nighttime, it does get a little harder because when you get up here a little further, you're going to have to turn, go into the dirt, and you don't want to be running into any rocks. And uh, personally, I hate doing time trials at nighttime, especially when you have to drive around vehicles and their lights are all like flashing in your eye and stuff like that. So now, boys, we're right here to the edge of the um, airport. So right here at the edge, this is where you want to take your first turn in the game. You're right. Now, right here, boys, you want to just, you know, stay as far away from these cars as possible. You just don't want to get in any type of wrecks because if you made it this far without any wrecks, you're going to win this race. I mean, I did this on my very first try, the first time I ever, ever, ever did it. And I did it on my first try to make this video as well. Now, check me out right here. That's all you got to do, boys. It's very, very easy. Now, I even went the wrong way up the hill and I still made it and had like five, six seconds left. Now, like I said, boys, this race is very, very easy, and I know you guys are going to get this race done straight away. The route is very, very easy, and if you follow it, I know you guys are going to get it done. Now, if you like daily GTA glitch and tutorial videos, daily Red Dead Online glitches, and NBA 2K content, make sure you subscribe for more and put your post notifications on to be notified the next time I drop another video. And like always, boys, peps out. Peace. Love.
and hair grease.